And a teacher for the blind is working hard to do something revolutionary that won't just help his students, but people all around the world. News 12's Joanna Hernandez tells us more. It's a tablet for the blind that will help the visually impaired do tasks those with sight can do. Started when uh, about five years ago when I was told like you're going to be teaching the art for the blind and low vision. And I tell you, honestly, I was like scared. It didn't take long for Daniel Luber to see that his students needed more. I call them like my co-designers because I was talking to them like the whole time. Like, what do you guys want? What do you do every day? How, how do you use that electronic? That's when he invented Braille Doodle and the Touchpad Pro, two devices that gets Kristen Smedley, the mother of two visually impaired boys, excited. There has never been, in all of my searches, something that gives you access to literacy and art. Products that would give students like Georgette an option to connect the iPad Pro to a TV and be able to read what's happening. It's hard to, like, ask people all the time like oh what is that or what are they doing if you're watching a movie. The goal is to have the Braille Doodle in the market by September and the iPad Pro ready to go in the next three years. Devices aim to give those visually impaired opportunities to keep thriving. 70% of those who are blind and low vision around 70% are unemployed okay Oh my god! because of not being able to access things. All that's left is the funding. A project like this costs millions of dollars, but they aren't giving up. They believe devices like this will be revolutionary. That's all that stands between all the kids having these in their hands in September to start school. The only thing standing in the way is the funding. Joanna Hernandez, News 12.